make a street version of the black blur. The black blurry. Black blur. Because it ain't gonna be a blur all the yeah. way. It'll be blurry though. <laughs> you can see it. Yeah. Okay. Make it a whole goddamn in and out custom ghetto legend black blur. All right, y'all, listen, man. Look, look what's going on. Look at these brand new parts, man. I'm talking about top of the line from all my partners and sponsors, man. Because they want y'all to go fast just like me. But, uh, but not too fast. You know what I'm saying? Click the link to get your tickets, man. Go to in and out custom.com. We about to break down this whole body work, whole metal, everything on Chase 71 Supercharged for it right now. I'm just gonna show y'all a little bit how we charge the AC up, make sure all the motor running good, make sure that thing hit the key. Then before we get into the paint and body work side of this stuff, man, because y'all know how paint shops do. They have you on paint jail. So make sure the motor running good, all that stuff working, the AC works. It's, it's my decision. Y'all heard when I get to the line and I pin it, pin it, pin it, pin it. That's that waste When I go one to it, oh, hey, that's that big turbo. When I get out there and let that pressure off, hey, that's that blow off valve. And that's why precision is my decision. Then we were getting on that. You see that? Brand new quarters for both sides. You know what I'm saying? Check it out. Now, look, we had to get the real tail light panel because the other one was rusty and tear out. Now look, we start with the passenger side first, cut it off, now we go flip to the driver's side. And then make sure the driver's side is the same as the passenger side. Then we go cut the ass in the car out, you know what I'm saying? You see how we just took that out? And then we go make it pop back, like voila, you know what I'm saying? Make sure the thing looking together like how it should be to make sure it's right. But y'all know we got some of the fastest welders in the game. Let me show y'all what we got going on. You see that? He got a race jacket on. <laughs> He got a real life race jacket on. <laughs> Check him out, man. We put this stuff together, man. So I'm gonna show y'all what, what I what, what I was telling him all before. <laughs> uh, you got a race jacket for the welder. You got a that's a welder race jacket. Welder race jacket. Yeah. <laughs> uh, that, that's a fast welder. <laughs> you must be a fast welder. Nothing fast about it. Huh? <laughs> 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 All right, y'all see the fans of the man. Look at he checking out. He put this work in. The body work is starting a little bit on it. They clean it up. You see the fitness skirt right there? We gonna talk about that in a minute. How we got that fitness skirt on there? All right, so we just showing y'all a little bit of what it looked like before, after, during. Just give y'all an idea of what it take to build some of these dunks when they be rusty, crusty. Let me show y'all this right here. We made up at history cars. Made this up a little nice and neat, something clean. But you gotta have good metal quarters to do this. You can't stick it in bondo, y'all. The quarter has to be metal to make it work Two like that. The side. And voila! Oh, magic! Oh, voila! <laughs> magic! Check it out, man. We'll do a little in depth on that later on. What's really going on? You know what I'm saying? So, we gotta take a little flathead, a little fill or something. I'm gonna get him filled. Fill up, right. we, we always have. Yeah. So, yeah. He, so now I'm going to paint it in. Yep. Thanks for that. Well, all this up, I'm finished there. I'm finished this. See, the same thing on this side. Got a patch up in there. Got a patch all up in there. The whole other side had a patch up. You about to finish all that now? Next. All right, now check out the back up. You see what I'm saying? Now that we started standing on a little bit, got the scenes on, got a little bondo and stuff on it, just to get, you know what I mean, just to clean up a little bit. I'm going to flip it on the passenger side, let y'all see what's going on. You know what I mean, make sure the body line line up with the dough, you know what I'm saying, flip it to the other side, make sure that look good. That's really what it is. Then, you know what I mean, we picked it up, we, we blacked it out, and it's on the trailer. You know what I'm saying, we about to take it to the body shop. Paint gel is what we call it, but you know what I mean? It's going there, make sure everything look right, make sure the bumper flowing with it. We can lift the bump up a little bit. That's just what we just taking it on. It's at the paint shop, you know what I'm saying? As y'all can see, it's at the paint shop. Look, 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 it's sitting at the paint shop. Now we gonna show y'all, it's still sitting there. They working on a little bit. They sat it down a little bit, but it's still sitting at the paint shop. You know what I'm saying? It sat there for a little minute, man. It sat there too long. 
So we had to take him on that paint shop and on the next video, y'all gonna see where it's at and what it's looking like and how it's coming. So we're gonna show y'all what it looked like. You know what I'm saying? This is where it's set at. Paint jail is what we call it. Motor cover up, everything look covered up. But guess where it's set at? The paint shop. That's where it been sitting at. It been sitting at the paint shop, y'all. So I'm gonna show you how we got the quarters on, everything on, but look at it. It's still at the paint shop. <laughs> Stay tuned, man.